My name is Dr. Ravi Amiya with Gateway Asthma and Allergy Relief. I am trained and board certified in pediatric and adult allergies, asthma, and immunology. Today, I'm here to talk to you about unique treatment options that I have to offer, which is cluster allergen immunotherapy. Since you get more vaccines at each visit, um, you start to notice the benefits much faster and you don't have to keep going to get your vaccines like conventional allergen immunotherapy where you have to go in every week for 30 weeks. For cluster, it's broken down into eight to 10 weeks. So yes, you're spending more time in the beginning getting the vaccines, but the benefit also comes within weeks and you don't actually have to wait for months in order to get some relief. An ideal candidate for cluster allergen immunotherapy would be somebody who suffered with allergy symptoms or allergic asthma for months or years. The fact that they've tried um, over-the-counter medicines to help their symptoms, also have had the chance to utilize the prescription medicines and still are not really where they need to be. Um, so those would be the people who would be ideal candidates for cluster allergen immunotherapy. We would skin test them, try to find out their allergen triggers, and then make a custom-built vaccine for them and start them on cluster allergen immunotherapy. To my knowledge, Gateway Asthma and Allergy Relief is the only place which is offering cluster allergen immunotherapy at this time in St. Louis region. That would include myself and my senior partner, Dr. William Johnson. I would recommend that people who are suffering from allergy symptoms or allergic asthma to visit their primary cares or their current allergists. Um, we would also be more than happy to help them if they have concerns and questions. I would encourage them to visit our website which is asthma-allergyrelief.com. Hello, my name is Heather Raines and I'm a patient of Dr. Ravi Amiya's. I've been a patient of hers for about 15 months now. Dr. Mia recommended the cluster immunotherapy treatments for me because I was suffering from severe animal allergies and some mild seasonal allergies. The benefits of the cluster immunotherapy is that you experience a relief in your symptoms much, much sooner. You know, again, I'm an impatient person, so waiting, you know, once I found out that there's relief, Waiting seven months for me was, you know, it wasn't even a thought in my mind. Why wait if I don't have to? Same, you know, same type of safety precautions. Um, you know, every there didn't seem to be any negatives on, on doing it other than a little bit of time commitment. But again, the benefits of the relief from my symptoms far outweighed the time commitment um, inconvenience. Make an appointment make an appointment, hands down, make an appointment. You come in, you learn more about what type of treatment is best for you. You also have an idea, even for those who are reluctant to participate in any type of immunotherapy for shots or you know they're nervous about it, at least coming in to understand and become educated on what it is that you're allergic to so you know when to start your course of treatments for your traditional medications or over-the-counter medications or whatever it is that's prescribed. Um, that was really um, eye-opening for me, for my son, to understand, you know, he's young so I'm not ready to um, bring him in for the shot treatments because he's terrified of needles, but at least I was able to learn when his seasonal allergies began what it is he's allergic to and when they end to know, okay, so we start all of his Zyrtec and, and his um, you know, nasal spray at Valentine's Day and we stop it at the first freeze or Labor Day, you know, whichever it is. And it's so easy to remember, but it makes sense to me. And now we're able to keep his, as, or his um, reactions to seasonal allergies under control. And in addition, what I've found too as a benefit is that Neither one of us, now that we have our, our allergies under control, are experiencing as many sinus infections or upper respiratory infections, which both of us um, would typically have a few a year.